Hi there, we're going to do Sky Boat Song. I'm going to teach you a little bit about um, the song, how it's structured and how you can play it beautifully. So, Sky Boat Song is a very old, beautiful, traditional Scottish song which has the story of the Bonnie Prince Charlie escaping from the Battle of Culloden on a small boat over to the island of Skye. So um, I'm going to just read out what it says at the beginning. So it says, The Sky Boat Song is a lullaby for Bonnie Prince Charlie, the young pretender to the British throne, as he is rowed to the Isle of Skye following the, the collapse of his army's invasion of Scotland at the Battle of Culloden in 1746. However, the song dates from much later than that, having been published in 1884. The words were written by Sir Harold Bolton and the tune was adapted by Annie MacLeod from a traditional Scottish rowing song. The rhythm of the melody suggests the gentle movement of the rower's oars. Okay, so, most of all, it's just a great tune. Here we go. Skyboat song. You can see this really distinctive rhythm. Da, 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 da. And this is really common in Scottish movies. <laughs> That's really that's a big feature of this song, isn't it? Happens all the way through. Dun, 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 dun. Do you know the words? Speed bunny bold like a bird on the wind over the sea to sky. Tarry the land that's born to be king over the sea to sky. Something like that. Have a listen to the words of the song. They're really nice. Do, 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 do. Okay, so if you haven't played it before, um, you've got a nice treat coming your way because actually it's not too difficult because there's lots of repetition of phrases. Do, 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 do. Okay, so it starts on a D. Do, do, do. And then up to a three. Do. Then it's almost the same, but on the A string, A, do, do, three. And then it um, goes down to the one on the A string, do, do, do. Back to hop to the one on the D string, do, do. And then finishes on the D. Once you've learned these four bars, you'll find they come up um, several times in the piece. So you're halfway there, really. So, D, one, D, three, and then the same on the A string. And then kind of opposite, instead of going D, uh, A, one, A, it's one, A, one. Pop the one over back to the D. No fingers. Okay. Now, in the music, you'll see then that there's a down bow sign. Where am I? Here. Okay, so here in the music you've got a down bow sign, so that means you've got to start with a down bow, but we finished do 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 down. So if we then start with a down, we'd run out of bow, so we need to do a bow circle here. 
so that we can start on a down again. Now, every time this happens, you've got this down bow in this piece that you have to do the same. You have to do a retake before. Okay, so watch out for those little down bow signs. I'm just going from bar seven. I've just done my retake. <laughs> And then you've got the the middle section. It starts at bar eleven. Now you can see it's a little pattern. So it starts on a one, and then it goes down two notes to the three, three one one, and then it goes all you move all of those notes down a note. Do, 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 do. So a, and then drop down to a one on the D. A do do do. And then go down a note again, three, one, three, 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 one. So it's a, like a little uh, pattern that keeps moving down, a sequence. Now to help you play this more easily with your left hand, I'm gonna give you a little tip. So one, three, one, one, can you see? I'm coming back to the one. So instead of going one, three, one, one, which wouldn't be very um, economical with my energy. So I'm just gonna go one, reach over with just my three, one, three, one, one, and then I can come back. One, three, one, one. And then I'm gonna go A, one, A, A, that's fine. Three, one, three, 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 one. Again, I'm not gonna put my two down. Three, one, three, 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 one. Because it means I've got to take off more things. So I'll just use three and one. Try and keep my hand relaxed. Okay, here we go. So one, step over my three. Back to the one. Step with the one and then get my one and three. Okay. And that happens twice, doesn't it? Do 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 Now that's a little bit of a slowdown in the music. How do we write a slowdown? Well, it's written like this with writ. Now writ is short for ritardando, which in Italian means gradually slowing down. A writ. So every time you see a writ in the music, that means gradually slowing down. Do, 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 And then you always get, when it goes back to the normal speed, it says a tempo, which means it goes back to the normal speed. Do, 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 do. And that's the first tune again, isn't it? So, I don't think you'll need much help with these notes. Once you've kind of got your head uh, round the tune and your ears round the tune by listening to it loads, I think you'll find this really quite straightforward. Things to remember, remember to do your bow retakes, like I said, just before your down, your extra down bows. And, and then we could, to, to add um, some dynamics um, and some slowdowns, you'll you will really add some character and some atmosphere to the piece. So let's have a look. Dynamics, loud and quiet. So MP, mezzo piano, medium quiet, then a crescendo, and then a little diminuendo off that note. Fading away. Growing through that. Fading away on that note. Now this one is kind of mezzo forte, medium loud. Do 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 growing through the crescendo here, getting loud up to the forte. This is the loudest bit. Do 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 lots of bow. Do 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 slowing down as well, getting quieter and slowing down. Back to the same, and look, it's piano here, quiet. Circle. Getting louder at the end. And also slowing down, because it's got a rip.
And then a quiet note at the end. Just going to play that through. See if you can spot on the music uh, what's, what's written in terms of dynamics, louds and quiets, crescendos growing, and the ritardandos slowing down. Okay. go well enjoy this piece it's a great one to add to your list of tunes that you know and it's really easy to remember so it's one you'll have forever so um yeah have fun hope this has been helpful <laughs>